shoes. I was up in here doing a self-care day like De'Ara Taylor. Stay tuned. <laughs> Oh, oh what's up? No, <laughs> no, no, I think she birdie. <laughs> Hold on. Baby, what you want? Wait, wait. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. This is Bubbles. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is a new week, so that means it's a new vlog starting right now. This week is going to be a maintenance week. I have not done that yet. Yes, you see the new hair. Mm -mm. Yes. If you want to know how I did that, I don't know how you're trying to be family. Check the video that I posted, which is my first time ever installing a lace front. This week, we're going to be doing a lot of maintenance for my nail tux. Yes, I said some teeth both. cleaning. Yada 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 yada. I ain't saying no more. You're just gonna have to keep watching. Anywho, let's Okay, go. guys, it's a new day. Nail still on fleek. Well, it's kind of shiny out here, but you can't see. But anywho, I'm on my way to the dentist. It's been a while since I've been because I've been scared to go to take off my mask in this pandemic. So, this is my first time in a while. So, hopefully, I could get a couple of clips. Okay guys, just seen the dentist. Went over some stuff to do with my teeth. Yes, it's been a while. I'm gonna take the bracket off. They did put it on because my jaw has shifted um, a long time ago and I had to wear this clamp to expand my jaw. And they're surprised that it lasted so long. It's about a good eight, nine years since I had that procedure done. But I'm gonna get my teeth cleaned and bleached and I can't wait. It's nothing like some clean teeth. And because I, I have an appointment later on to do a chemical pill. Yes, I told y'all this is a maintenance week. How's my skin looking? Anyway, my skin is clearing up. I'm so excited about that. But anywho, my doctor's mad cool. I'm gonna try and get some footage of them cleaning my teeth. So stay tuned. Make sure I don't have enough water in here. Yes, I do. If not, I will just stop this for a little bit. Before, we're going to see what it looks like after. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Still sitting in the dentist. I had to pay. I still have insurance, but for some reason it's not sh um, showing the dental. So I just went ahead and paid cash. Eleven eighty-two, eighty-three. My bad. Anyway, gotta be done. This bracket's gonna be getting fixed, which is sticking me in my tongue. So I really don't have other choice but to pay it. Went ahead and took care of that. Um, now I'm just waiting. Why am I swaying? waiting for them to come in to start the work you know they gotta take that payment mm -hmm. y'all gotta make sure y'all take care of your teeth because i'm telling you right now everybody always compliment me about my teeth but you know what this teeth ain't happen overnight i like my little bit <laughs> and if you don't i know some people who don't never go to the dentist and they always want to complain about how they mouth hurting them and 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 how they teeth fall now i ain't trying to have my teeth fall i do not like dentures in my mouth so I'm going to do my best to try and take care of them. I mean, of all else fell and I lose my teeth, God forbid. Jesus, please. 
I'm going to get me some implants, okay? And they're going to be the whitest teeth you ever seen in your life. <laughs> but, <laughs> I know everybody getting those veneers and them porcelain, this and that. But I just can't see myself shaving down my teeth, even if it's just a little bit. Just to put some teeth on that every 10 months I have to go and do maintenance on. I'd rather have my natural teeth. Everybody love it. I get a lot of compliments on my teeth. Matter of fact, I had to wear braces four times, okay? And I had um, somebody say to me, matter of fact, it was my sister-in-law said that to me some years ago. Thought, thought I got some dentures. Oh, I gotta go. Gotta go. See? Wait, are you going to hold that? No. I gotta put the steam. Oh, oh. oh my God. <laughs> I'll turn it so down so it won't see you. It's perfect. It's perfect. See? <laughs> Wait, hold my thighs. You gotta use all body parts. Yeah. Yeah. Challenge. <laughs> I am an expert now. That's pretty good. So tall see? and everything. All we see is your pecs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Don't bring I have a very handsome doctor. <laughs> Don't be jealous. Are you married? I am. He's married. off the market. Been married guys. 23 years. Oh, three kids. kids. Don't be asking. <laughs> He's married with three kids and he is happy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead and open. All right, so it might be a little sensitive from the cold water here while we're working. If you need a break or anything, just raise your hand, okay? Do what you gotta do. Funny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so I'm, gonna, I'm gonna pause that a bit more. <laughs> Feels a lot different, huh? Yes. <laughs> better. I feel better there. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> Those glasses. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. Could you? <laughs> Wait. I, I'm sorry. You're gonna make Look at the glasses. I, I just Look at the help. forehead. The forehead. <laughs> Listen, I have a big forehead, so you don't feel bad. I'm about to measure my forehead right now. Do you know that? <laughs> I can't take no more. I have the coolest doctor in the world. That's right. Mm -hmm. Tell everyone. Dr. Nelson. Oh, they look white already. I know I need to put a new bag in it. Get ready. I am done with my dentist appointment. My doctor is the best. I'm going to leave his information down below. He is a sweetheart. Um, very funny down to earth. Now like them stuffy doctors. Anywho, I know I need to let y'all know what I'm doing. But I am running late. It is 2.28. I got to go party. I didn't even stop to pee. And I need to shoot to the next town over. Get my um, chemical pill which that hopefully traffic's not too bad but um it should take me maybe up to 30 minutes 20 minutes 25 minutes 30 minutes to get there and hopefully there's no traffic i mean it's 228 so hopefully it's not rush hour i don't know why they call it rush hour because it's they sure be driving slow
Okay, guys, just finished my dentist appointment. I have to go back in two weeks um, to pick up my new retainer and my bleaching stuff, thingamajiggy. Anywho, I was on my way for my chemical peel, which I'm kind of glad that they canceled on me because it was just giving me 30 minutes to get there, and that would have been with traffic. Oh, my God. The doctor pulled out my... um my uh what you call it my permanent retainer on top and it feels so funny i haven't felt the top of my mouth in about 10 plus years and i ain't making this up i took my braces off about who about nine eight nine years ago matter of fact before i had the braces i had a um before i had i can't even talk <laughs> let's start over Before I had the braces, I actually had a clamp on the top of my mouth to expand my jawline on top because this side of my um, jawline shifted in. We're going to have to really try with this um, thing here because I can't talk. <laughs> and before that, well, when I had the retainer, when I had the clamp in my mouth, I had it for seven months. So... Add that all into the equation. I still have my bottom retainers in, but right now, I feel like I'm talking with a list. I got so used to having that bar in the top of my mouth, I'm having problems even pronouncing my words. And it feels like my teeth gonna fall out. So bear with me if I sound funny. Um, lips probably ashy because I just got from under the table. Yes, girl. I know my dentist is cute, but he is married, okay? So don't be writing down below but how you you want his number. But I will give you his business number, and I will give you the dentist that I go to because he is the shizness, okay? He's located in Scottsdale, Arizona, and he's wonderful. All the ladies there are nice. If you some guys want to see you some pretty dentist hygienist and stuff like that, you come here, okay? Because they nice too. Anywho, let me go before I need to put on a diaper because I got to pee. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I'm just clumsy. I had to knock my hand on the mirror. Fix it, Jesus. I made a pit stop to see if I have any mail. I hope somebody sent me some nice goodies. So I don't know if it is legal for me and videotaping, but until somebody tell me, son, I ain't showing nobody's face. And yes, I did use my feet to open the door. Anywho. You know what, guys? Ain't nothing in the mailbox, okay? But anyway, I still love y'all. Time to go. Well, my hands are full for one, and two, I don't like touching the hands that everybody else been touching. So, I'll use my feet just now. I'm hungry, and plans have changed. So, oy, let me get in this car. Sometimes I feel like I'm the only one who wears a mask around here. Oh, got a phone call. It's my new manager. <laughs> Making a stop at Whataburger. My doctor, let me get a better light. My doctor's so nice. I just left the dentist and he's texting me already to say, Aww, Dr. Nelson is so sweet. Aww, they want it. I, I will show you the text. It says, I'll read it to you. Hello, this is Dr. Nelson office. It was so nice to see you in our office again. Okay, I don't normally eat water burger, but we're gonna pay for the food. I'm actually texting my doctor right now and paying. I don't know if this is safe, but we're gonna do. We're gonna do. What we gotta do. I just um, text the doctor back. He, I'm telling you, he is so nice. It's very hard to find a doctor that is very nice and kind and down to earth, and he is definitely one of those people. I mean, 
He always giggling and he, he smiling. You know, you, you get them dentists. They be making you scared to even blink your eye. They so damn rude and so stuck. <laughs> Everybody there is so pleasant. Oh, my God. Beautiful people. I don't know if he had... He must handpick all his staff because all the doctors I've ever been to, they are the best. And even though I do not live close to him I still will drive 45 minutes to come and see him just because of the experience I always get from him he is a doll and I'm gonna leave a nice link down below y'all check him out if y'all ever in the area of Scottsdale and need your teeth to look pearly white he's your guy thank you on another note my trip to Guyana got canceled um I'm on vacation now as we speak, even though I'm supposed to be out of the country at this moment. But don't fear, I will be still be going. I just have to plan it for another time. It just wasn't lining up when I tried my job. I put in my vacation time about a month and change before it was due to happen. And it did not say approve until, put it this way. I went to work the whole week and then Thursday when I left it didn't say it didn't say that it was approved it just said submitted still Friday which was my last day when I went in the morning it actually said approved now mind you I should have been leaving on a plane that Sunday and this was Friday normally to fly from Arizona to go to South America is normally about 700 and change but the ticket was running about just under a thousand dollars so imagine how much it was when I went to try and buy it two days before I was supposed to leave. Hi guys, I am now at MedSpot and I'm about to get... I know. Wow. I don't even know how I got the coupon. Um, because the last time you were in, we um we signed you up for the alley program. Oh and they yeah. And had a double point thing going on, and you just did it on the right day, and you got extra points. Mm -hmm. so, so next time, though, you'll have a, you'll still get your twenty dollar coupon towards your next treatment. Oh good. Any good plans for the weekend? Uh, no, nothing really. Take it easy for the weekend. Just do some spring cleaning. That's yeah. nothing fancy. I'm the same way. I'm just gonna. <laughs> we got a pretty quick, easy day today, so I'm just gonna go home and chill. <laughs> yeah, I, I do need to paint, so I might do a little painting. Ooh, that sounds like my work. bedroom. <laughs> but you know what? I love to paint, That's, so that's not work for me. <laughs> I think you either love it or hate it, because I hate it, and Sarah loves it. She I, really, I, I love like, it. It is too tedious for me <laughs> it's relaxing think about it it's just you and the paint <laughs> I guess I it wrong. <laughs> oh and i need to make an appointment for uh chemical peel you got it okay the quickest appointment i ever had okay as you can see as soon as that doctor told me to lay down that table it was like wham bam thank you ma'am like damn can i have a cigarette 
one thing I love about Med Spa. This place I've been coming here for years. I at one point I would get chemical pills on the regular, like to clear up my face with the marks and the acne. Um, I'll come three, four months in a row, had the chemical pill done, and then I'm good. After that, it's maintenance every other month, two, three months. But I haven't been going due to this pandemic. My face has suffered. I have bad allergies, and I break out with hives, and sometimes they leave marks. My um, When is that time in the month? I do tend to um, break out. Hold on. I know you can hear the AC, but I'm sorry. It is now 89 degrees here in Arizona. So, now I am back on my regimen, and as you can see, my face is clearing up. I don't have any makeup, just my regular eyeliner. I will do a video of my regimen that I'm doing is helping to clear up my face. Now, cleaning up your face, don't listen to all these YouTubers. I mean, it might be for some, but for most of us, it is not a one-week process. It does take some time, um, but as long as I'm not having current breakouts, I will be okay. And it doesn't matter how old you are, you can still get acne 30s, 40s, 50s, and I have seen people in their 60s having acne. So. There's different reasons. I have been to specialists and it'll clear it up. My skin get used to it or it's too harsh. There's always something. So now I am doing more natural stuff and I might be using, and I'm using one thing that's not natural. One thing I love about Men's Spa, they do have a doctor that does the injections. It just makes me feel better. Everybody know I'm the kind of person that you will hear me laughing before you see me walk into a room. I love to laugh. I'm normally a happy person. I cannot help it. People say, you don't act like that in real life, you know, when they see me on my videos. But I actually do. I am goofy. I'm clumsy. And I love to laugh. I don't need no drugs. I don't need no alcohol. I'm naturally on a happy high. I'm naturally on a happy high. I don't need nothing. So, the side effects of that is, is crow feet and some people get laugh lines. Anywho. My mother, at the age of 60, she passed away. Yes, I miss her dearly. The only wrinkle she had was the crow feet. The, the best thing you could do to prevent that is Botox. So I figure at my age now, I should start doing it so it won't get worse. It's to prevent the wrinkles from happening. And I'm more for the natural stuff, but sometimes, you know, you got to do what you the doctor do. said. I would notice a difference starting in three to four days and it takes up to two weeks to get the full effect. Don't be afraid to get it done. It is safe and just go to the right places. I mean, me personally, I just love coming here and I'm just so happy they have a doctor to actually do it. I will leave the information down below if anybody would like to come to Med Spa. They do everything from stuff to make you lose weight to face, any kind of facials from chemical peel to dermablations, you name it. As you can see, Botox, all of that. They do everything here. This week is going to be a maintenance week. So, got some Botox. I will be getting a chemical peel. I am going to be doing my hair right now. That's why I got, well, I love to tie my hair down. That's just my, that's my thing, okay? <laughs> I love scarves. I love scarves. I go wear a scarf every day. And I have a scarf to match every outfit. You swear I cut the cloth off of the outfit to put it on my head. Hi, Bubbles family. I know it's a new day. And I haven't been able to take much just because I've been busy doing things around the house and trying to grow my brand. But I'm about to get me. Why is he ramming that car every time I'm trying to do a tape? I think that man do that on purpose because he see me with the camera. But anywho, like I was saying, I'm heading to Cane's to get me um, some food. I'm going to try and do, a, I call it commercial for Instagram for Cane's. If you want to see how the video came out, you need to go and check out my IG. You have to follow me over there, which is Bubble Pleasant under every one of my platforms. That's my TikTok, that's my IG, and of course this channel. Don't be a stranger. Check it out. I just wanted to catch this light. I went to Cane's to try and do this commercial, and of course, 
the clothes so I'm hungry I decided to get me some BK now I didn't eat because I figured I'd do this commercial and, and, and yeah that backfired now I'm hungry I did not cook and I'm gonna drive through a BK getting me a Whopper anywho don't make no sense to waste this little bit of makeup I got on so I figured I'd just vlog and vlog some more oh what do y'all think about these contacts I'm trying them out and it's supposed to be for a brand so we're checking to see how it feels so I'll let y'all know all about it in a little but stay tuned alright I'm waiting for my food I'm still in the drive-thru it's about at least 10 minutes I've been sitting here was only one vehicle in front of me so I don't know what happened Thank you. Burger Kings for champions I'm taping you some mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Are you still talking? <laughs> Stop talking! You got me stopping and holding up traffic. Alright. <laughs> Let's go. I wanted to take some um pictures, but I don't have the right equipment to take the picture. I don't know. I'm like everything is just not working out. I don't know, I, I tried to, um, <clears throat> to be a good YouTuber and vlog, but it, yeah, it, it's not working, okay? Alright, so I guess I am just going to head home. I'm going to eat my food. I'm going to make a couple of TikToks. If you have not, have not started following me on TikTok, what is you waiting for, okay? I'll be doing my thing! <laughs> It's only been a couple of weeks and I'm growing. I'm over a thousand subscribers. I mean, it's growing faster than my freaking YouTube channel. Okay, guys, I am home. I have my fries. I really have my mind set on some canes, but they ain't work out. Oh. Am I the only one who likes to um, eat, eat my fries with ketchup and mayo? I don't think so. All right. Take a bite. Mwah! <laughs> I do take the bottom off of my burgers. I know. It's different. That's just me. It's too much bread. Too much bread for me. I give it to my crazy bird. Or oh, when I have my dogs, I said give it to them. Take a bite. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Nothing like a whopper. Mm. Mm, yeah, mm, yeah, mm, mm. <laughs> the shit I gotta do. <laughs> mix up my ketchup and um mayo so it look like this now my nickname that I gave myself many years ago was a hamburger queen because I love me a burger mm -mm -mm. I'm over here dancing and chewing. That's when you know the food good. When it make you move, you start dancing. Or start humming. And yes, don't judge me. Yes, I put my Burger King in a fancy plate. Call me bougie if you like. That's just me. You want me to start doing some mukbangs again, huh? Let me know. Uh, 
Oh yes, it's time to do that manicure and pedicure. Well needed and definitely deserved. Okay guys, just finished doing my nails. You won't believe the afternoon I had. I went someplace else to do my nails. <clears throat> and take this off. Now you can hear me. Oh. So before I get in the car, let me talk to y'all. Is my lens dirty? Yes. Ugh. Okay. I was having a crazy day today. I went to go and get my nails done and the guy was so damn rude I actually got up and told him I don't want him touching my hands. So <laughs> I end up going to a new spot which I've been to this place one time a, a long time ago and I ain't gonna lie this place is legit. The whole time I was there the lady was cleaning and sweeping and disinfecting. They had on masks. They had the thing in the front. Yes I'm loving this place and here are the nails. I know, I know, it's not what I normally get. It's neutral. You know, I don't got none of that shock color on today. Only because <clears throat> I do have to do a photo shoot. And I couldn't get, I'm not sure what color outfit I'm going to be wearing. So I have to do something that's very neutral. So that's why I got these. <clears throat> Excuse me. Anywho, I've been doing enough talking. I need to get out of here. And I need to go home and edit and put up this other video tonight. Hopefully. If not... It'll be up tomorrow. Anyway, guys, I see you on a bit. On my way to get a chemical peel right now. As you can see, I don't have any powder. Normally, I put powder, but lately, I've been having to put on a little foundation to try and cover up some of these marks that I have, but they are fading, as you can see. So, we're going to get a treatment. Hopefully, I could get some taping of this. I haven't had one done in a while, but since my face is almost totally cleared up, except for a couple of really dark spots, one here and here, to here anywho let me go and boost up the process of my skin clearing up i can't have my skin looking a hot mess i'm in my car driving to my appointment and so i don't know if i'm gonna get a regular chemical pill or i'm gonna get the i think it's a pumpkin one i'll let y'all know hopefully i get some footage normally when i get my chemical pills i do not go back outside at all this is actually early for a chemical peel for me. Normally I do my chemical peels like around 4 o'clock because then I stay in the house. But I got to do what I got to do. This is the time I have available and I don't know because when you get a chemical pill you can't go outside for at least, well you could go outside but you need to protect your face from heat. And this is Arizona, you know it's hot here. It actually right now is not bad it's 78 but the Sun can react the acid back in your skin and the process will continue to go we don't want to do that because I will get burned so I guess I'll just get this done go in the house work on the channel inside the house work on my brand 
Um, I've been trying to post every day on Instagram. If y'all have not been checking me out, please go and subscribe to my my Instagram, which is Bubbles Pleasant. And I'm now doing TikTok. I know I have said this before, but I know some people's new here. I'm doing TikTok, and it's growing. Please be family over there. It, like I said, Bubble Pleasant is my name on all my social media out there. Yes, I'm driving and taping because I got to do what I got to do. I'm running late. It is 9:45, and my appointment is at 10. So <laughs> I'm trying to hurry up. I see y'all in a little. Just keep doing what I was doing. Yeah, it looks like I'm not feeling anything big underneath the surface. Mm -mm. It, yeah, we're we're definitely in the home stretch. It's patience, but man, you've been very consistent. You've been so good, and that's why you're seeing all these benefits. good because so many people you know don't are aren't honest about mm -hmm. things that they're doing and it's mm -hmm. like how is anybody going to find out what the options are if you're not honest and that's what people told me like you're so real i'm like i'm just me yeah somebody's like she's not like that in real life but I, i'm really like this in real life. <laughs> i'm always giggling i'm always cracking yep. jokes that's just me I mean, yeah. I can vouch for it. <laughs> yeah, and everybody's happy person, but I am. I ain't yep. gonna lie. I would say so. So I'm, you know, I'm gonna show my flaws. I have a, I'm very conscious about my skin, but there's other people out there that's struggling. Absolutely. Like me, so I figured, let me just come out of my comfort zone and I'll show them. I think that that is, um, that's huge. <laughs> in general. A lot of these people out there, they done did all this stuff and acting like, no, this is me. I just did it. Why yeah. is you lying? You did. <laughs> right? Jennifer Lopez, um, I, I'll just, I'm throwing her under the bus because mm -hmm. that's just one that I was like, hmm, right. So she was trying to say it like when she did that Super Bowl show. Mm -hmm. And she was like, I, and everybody was like, oh, you know, like Botox filler, like what do you do? And she's like, mm -hmm. I do not do Botox. And it was like, honey, you have bat wings on your forehead. The yeah. only way you get it is from Botox. So wow. you are not being honest. So I went and got the Botox. I'm going to put it out there because <laughs> why am I going to lie? No kidding. You know, I, and to be honest, I, and I told him, I said, my mother, the only wrinkle she had was on the side of her eyes. And for what I understand, Botox is one way to try and like prevent that. Yes. Thing. I said, so why not do it? Yes. I'm not going to sit here and lie and say, 
I didn't do this and that. I'm going to try it. And if I like it, I'm going to definitely, I'm going to tape it. And after that, if I like it or not, I tell them. Because they always ask, how did it go? I'm like, well, you see it. <laughs> right? I love Botox, man. I Did you notice a difference or an improvement? Or are you just doing it for preventative reasons? I don't know. Well, it wasn't horrible. And even he said, it's not bad. Yeah. But I don't want it to get bad. Right. You, know, you just keep putting that in your face and it'll atrophy the muscle and it won't create that dynamic expression. To put it on your forehead besides your eyes. Mm -hmm. Where else? Forehead, upper lip, you can give. It works for some people. I'd say it's, I know, to me it seems like it's about a 50-50 whether or not people like it or it works for them. But you can do a little bit right on that upper lip to give it a little bit of a flip. Um, but with that said, I've also, I had it done one time and I didn't like it because anytime I went to go and try and use a straw, which isn't often, but it was, I just didn't like it. It was like, you can't. Or if you take a sip and it's like a little bit too much, then you dribble all over yourself. So there's that aspect of it as well. But it's very, very slight. It's very subtle. You can do it there. You can do Botox um, in the, um, you know, have you seen like really prominent, um, like the bands in the neck? Mm -hmm. You can put Botox into those to soften those. Do I got bands? No, no, you do not have bands. <laughs> no, no, not I'm at all. I'm just curious. <laughs> Okay, we are about to put on some sunblock, yes. which we've been struggling to find my skin tone color. I was coming out looking like Casper, but we're going to see. That's not it. She said. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay if it don't match. I'm going home anyway. Okay. Well, I'm going to work on a couple of these colors. Just you, yeah. a little warmer than that one. That one's a little bit too cool for your skin. Well, you could use me as a guinea pig. Thank you. Anytime. <laughs> Wear this um, every day, that sunblock, if you find the right color. Yes, so this is the uh, BB cream from Lyra. And this BB cream has stem cells in it, so it's actually healing. It's completely breathable as well. It's a 30 SPF. Mm. Like, I'm not recommending you sleep in it, but you can sleep in it. It's a perfect product for um, also for after post treatment. Well, if we were to find the right color, I could wear it. <laughs> yeah, right? Well, we're also doing this in the dark right now, so hopefully I am at That's least okay. close enough to it. Because of the little peel that we have underneath, mm -hmm. if I rub it, it'll roll. So oh, that's yeah. why I'm kind of blotting here. Mm -hmm. but I, I heard that's how you're supposed to put on makeup anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Even though it's sunblock. Yes. Because I wear sunblock every day. So if I could find something and give it a little tint to match, that's even better. Oh, I think you're going to like <clears> this <throat> a lot if I'm close to your color. We're going to find out when I go outside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> About to be revealed. How are we looking, people? Ooh. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> oh, glowing, <Hello>. darling. <laughs> okay, guys, I am fresh out of the med spa. <clears throat> Excuse me. I need to eat some food and, and have some breakfast. I ain't even gonna lie. It is now 11 11. Mmm. That is the second time I've seen 11 11. Okay, now the gods are speaking to me. Another story. I just finished my chemical peel, and I will say this is the best my skin has looked in a while. I haven't been getting any chemical pills, I haven't been taking care of my skin like I normally do with getting all these things done because really with this pandemic thing going on, I didn't want to take my mask off, stuff like that. So, so I haven't been going to get any treatments. <clears throat> I find when I get treatments done, um, my skin is beautiful and flawless. Okay. Now that I have this new regimen that doesn't include some harsh medications on my face from a dermatologist, this is actually working. Now this is just the backlash of it trying to clear up all these little marks on my face. Anywho, I hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog of me doing all this craziness to myself. If you enjoy these kind of videos, let me know down below. Let me know if you want me to do a certain procedure or whatever. I don't know I'm going to do it. But I definitely take it into consideration. Alright. Anywho. 
please don't be a stranger i'm looking forward to seeing y'all comments down below what you think how my skin is looking i'm trying to be real here on this channel i'm not trying to be one of those people who lie about things that they do that they ain't doing and walk around talking about all you gotta do is this and you look good this is my first time really trying out Botox. This is me, me and the room. And thank you, you guys, who's been following me and who's rocking with me. Tell your friends, tell your family all about the bubbles. Anywho, I will see y'all next time. Ta -ta. I love you guys. <laughs>I um I can't talk. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think I'll be making any videos today. Oh what was I saying? <laughs> I probably had to cut this part out.